Back at the beginning of the course, we worked a lot with exponents, so if you remember that well, then great. But if not, let's look at a certain pattern. We know that 2 to the second power is 4, and we know that 2 to the first power is 2. 2 to the 0 is 1. So every time we decrease our exponent by 1, we're having the numbers over here. So if we need to have 1 to get 1 half, which is what we're looking for, then we need to decrease this exponent one more time. So that means that 1 half should be equal to 2 to the negative 1. That means we can write log base 2 of 1 half as log base 2 of 2 to the negative 1. That just gives us negative 1.